back in New Hampshire on Sunday, October 4th. Trav's been seeing a lot of does in this piece of woods. I just set up in this realm open boat flat here. I'm going to try to use the tree dive before they usually come. The wind's coming right in my face. Bedding's in front of me. There's also some bedding to my left, so it's going to be tricky. My bow is set up on my weak side. Just the way things happen to fall. I have a feeling the shot's going to be off to my weak side. Ooh, we're in. Excuse my nasty style infection. In my eye there. right there. Yep, getting her last boots right now. Alright, so I just sent Travis a Snapchat. It's not a big one, but it's meat in the freezer. Easy drag to the truck. Probably 180 yards. 
cards. First New Hampshire White Tail down. Three more tags to go. Nice and early, still got an hour. <sighs> so, just to give you guys more of a idea of what happens in here. So the bedding area is over there. About 150. The deer always come from there. And they usually come this way. And I haven't been set up close enough, so they never really make it to me. And then there's a field over there, about 100 away. There's a field behind me over here, about 100 away. The trucks are about 150 away. I came in from that tree way over there that's down. Straight in. That deer just came pretty much right from where we came in. I've seen that one before, it's not big, but it likes this spot. And I had a feeling if I really wanted to punch a tag, I could make it happen by setting up right here. I literally get done doing that interview. And that deer was right behind that birch. that's leaning right there. I don't know how I didn't hear it, but it come right in on me. She's dead. Right over there, probably about 80 yards. Her to go down. Still gonna give her a little time. I gotta climb down, tear all this equipment down. Of course, I finally got a, the video of a, a bow kill for the channel from myself. And uh, I got this big nasty stat infection on my eye, but no big deal. It is what it is. Just psyched to uh, have one going in the freezer. Now I'm gonna be back at it tomorrow. Not New Hampshire, but pretty close to the border. I'll be over in Maine, hunting this nice scrape line I found. Me and Hunter are gonna be in the woods. Um, unless things change, and I decide to go back where we hunted opening week. But we're gonna get this one out in the truck, tagged, back to Maine I go. Should be big enough to stuff right in the uh, soft freezer. I'll set that thing right to like 36 degrees and I'll let her, let her sit in there for a couple days. I'll get the hide off and I'll let her sit in there and chill and bleed. And I'll give that a rinse and get to cutting. Finally, that's how it's done right there. I'm get some of this. Yeah, so this is where she must have initially crashed. Come in from right there. Yeah. Yeah, she came blasting through all this. That's why I heard her. All right. Yeah. That was a high shot. Straight down. That way.